Hey, what is up guys, it's Zyrus HD, and this is episode number 3 of the dual build between myself and Andy as Yoda. If you haven't already guys, in the description down below are going to be links to part 1 and part 2 on Andy's channel. Go check him out, go sub to him. We are currently on Use the Block server, using Use the Blocks texture pack from Andy's, uh, Andy's pack, so... All this information will be in the link description down below, guys. Do check it out. There's a lot of good information there. So what are we going to do? I mean, let's have a look at what Andy's done. Absolutely amazing. I can already visualize what we're actually going to do on this episode. Look at that. We're all going to put all the cars and stuff. Beautiful. So you know what I'm thinking? If I remove this sign, because this is just temporary, just to you know, give this place a name, christen it. <laughs> um, we move this and we move it up on here and uh, I think what we might do as well is what was that um, we might actually move it over here and then might create a logo on another episode might just jot down a few ideas and you know create the Aztec logo anyway let's go off oh. By the way, off camera, what I've gone and done as well, guys, is I've actually extended this grass right down to the corner and here again. So that way, all I have to do now is do a bit of terraforming in here and uh, here to make it look more natural. So without any further ado, let's grab some blocks and get straight into it. So I'm going to use some quartz slabs all right and i'm just going to put this roughly like that and then i'll move it into shape later on so go like that pop that there full block there we go and we put this yeah i started off with as mech like as mechanics and uh, I had a person say, you know, why don't you try it to you know, change it to Aztec. Actually, I'll put that like that. I think that looks a lot better. I love doing my E's in Minecraft like this. And we'll drop that down as well. Yeah, Aztec was like technologies and, uh, and stuff like that. So why not? So thank you for that, mate. I like hearing from you guys to let us know if we're doing things right or wrong. There we go. So we're going to have like Aztec. And don't worry about the color, guys. This is all going to change. Um, I don't know if Andy mentioned it. I think he did uh, about the colors and stuff. I'm going to just frame out the stuff and change it later on. So I'm just going to run the line through here. So I also like doing this framing off my sort of... Uh, lettering and labeling and stuff so we chuck that through here just like smack the mouse button here like that and I might bring this red up to be in line with uh, Andy's block so I'm just gonna do this actually you know what I've got weld edit so I'm gonna do weld edit so I'm gonna click from this position I'm gonna go all the way down to this position and I'm going to do that, which will bring it up quite high. Look at that. Absolutely amazing. All right, so I'm going to do this as well on the corners. So we're going to grab it from this point down to here. Set 35, colon 14. And back again this side yeah we'll get started on the mechanical pit today as well guys I think um, that will go really well for people who are building cars now why didn't that work all right we'll try again we'll go this way um, oh we got uh, possessed tiger up there how you doing buddy oh, my game glitched out sorry guys so we can just click that there and down here, set to the 514. So I'm just framing this off really nicely now. 
And that's going to give us a nice span roof as well, so we don't get everything cluttered. So 35, 14. Okay, so now we've done that, I can actually go and move the sign. So I might center that very shortly. Actually, I might do a bit of it now. Let's go like this. Like this. Slash slash move three right. Ah, I'll play with it. I'll play with it. But I'm going to center that. And I might uh, click that as well. And bring this here. Slash slash move one up. There we go. So we've got that. And I'll center that. And I'll put a nice logo on it as well. This is going to look absolutely freaking amazing. Um, another one as well, I also got told to put a doorway in here. Uh, so you can actually walk inside. So I might do that as well. See how that looks. We go three. Yeah, three. We'll go leave that. And let's move right into the mechanical pit. So what I've gone and done off camera, guys, is I've just labeled out uh, some markings. It's in line with the center of the vehicle. And... Uh, they're all in line with each other. So my best bet is if we dig out this, say one, two, three, four, five, five wide, we can take out that and move it over by one block. And do the same again, knock that out. We can dig down a bit further. Like so. And what we can do as well, if we wanted to, is grab ourselves some what are they cobblestone should we use cobblestone stairs now we're going to use stone bricks and I'm going to place a block here a cobblestone stair here and here so that way we can get up and get down and actually I'm going to make this a bit longer and wider actually there's going to be plenty of room Pop that there, that there, and that there. Up and down. Dig that out. Stone. Stone stairs, stone stairs. So we've got our mechanical pit. That looks pretty amazing. Pretty amazing indeed. Uh, we can dig this out. Now I'm still contemplating if I should make this deeper so we can actually make it wider. But we'll see and plan it by ear. Alright, that's not too bad. That's not too bad at all. You know what, I'm going to keep that. I am going to keep that. So, what we might do is run right across here and just peg this out. So, I'm going to chop that. And then we're going to continue to chop this one. Look down the end. Move that across. And chop out that one. And that is two blocks down guys just like that and we move that one back and we pop that in there stone stair and stone stair oh let's change the time p time at noon give you guys some extra light and we'll pop that here one and two so hopefully that is all matched up nicely we've got our pits happening all right chop that up how is everyone doing um i've had a mega response uh from this uh episode one video guys thank you so much for your support you don't realize how much i'm thankful and uh i'm quite excited about doing this uh dual build with andy I really am. Maybe we can do a lot more in the future. That would be absolutely awesome. Right, so. Block at either end. And we can put our stairs in as well. And that gives us, what, a four block radius to move around and, and whatnot. Now let's see. Have we got... 
bedrock. What's bedrock? Let's have a look. Is there any pattern in that? No. Okay, I'm just going to leave that. Okay, so now that we've got that, uh, we're going to... Actually, before I forget, I'm going to go over here because I have to make something for the roof. So I'm going to go over here and I'm going to lay out some stone. So one, two, three, four. Four blocks. So I'm going to bring this out like that. I think that'll be enough. Maybe another two or three. Like that. Um, I'll be working on the interior as well as the exterior on um, I'm building this. I'll just check that in here. Continue the run. Like that. And fill this with stone. Now I keep forgetting I got world edit. I keep forgetting. Here we go. So do this. Set one. Okay, we've got stone. What we're going to do now, guys, is we're going to go and grab a couple of things. We're going to grab some quartz stairs, and we're going to also grab some quartz blocks. We're going to put that one away, and then we are going to go and grab some weighted pressure plates. And uh, saying that, we're going to come out by one. Actually, leave space one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to turn the stairs upside down. And we're going to come around this way. Pop them in upside down as well. Just like that. And then we're going to grab a block here, here, and here. Run this back because we are going to make a massive gas, gas tank. And we can fill this in because we don't need that. Gas tank. Like that. And pop one here one here and then close that off like that so we have a nice gas tank for the mechanics I think they'll be quite impressed and happy we can start doing some welding I'm um, just filling the tops here guys with the, the blocks and with your heavy weight pressure plates just space them out let's have a look maybe put one there Oh, two space gap so I need to bring that there and move this out by one there's nothing worse than not being symmetrical in Minecraft it doesn't work and it looks terrible uh, pop that there and in there as well come on there we go all right, so let's have a look. That's all symmetrical now, beautiful. And we shall bring this out one more block, guys. One more, and then we can actually go and grab some mossy cobblestone. Bring that out, connect that up, and we can connect it in like that. So it looks like it's connected through. And I'm just gonna knock that block out so we can run that through so it looks legit from the other side. So like that. Like that. Okay, so that's all connected through. And that looks amazing. Grab some buttons. Actually, you know what we're going to do? We're going to make a pattern. With three colors. I think yellow, orange, and red. Yeah, that, that, and the red. I think that'll be a great color for some gas butane tanks. And we're also going to grab a couple of buttons and whack them in just like that. Yeah, I like that. Actually, I'm going to stick that one there. Look at that. Beautiful. All right, quickly do this now. Grab some iron bars, and we're going to extend this out one more as well. And with your iron bars, we're just going to run that around. So I think that's 101. Yep. Grab weld edit. Come up to about here. Weld edit that. Set 101. 
So we just enclose that off. And I'm going to have to bring this out one more. So we don't get the barbed wire stuck on the actual butane tank. Butane? Butane. Yeah. Alright, so once again we're going to connect that. And we'll edit this to this point. Oh, that point. Knock that one out. And in here. Come on. Set 101. And from this point, we're going to go all the way down to here. Like that. All right. Okay, so we've got that closed off now. We just fill in this little bit here. Take that off here and here. So that's closed off. Maybe that's a bit too high. That's too high. Um, close that off around to there, I think. Cut. Cut. Come on. This doesn't always work. Why is that working? Manually. I'll do it manually then. Chop it away. I think that'll be quite quite sufficient, I think. I just don't know why I went up so high. But sometimes you have them enclosed off so no one can actually jump in on the top. Right, so we've got that happening. And what I also might do as well, because I like putting detail in my builds very much so. So I'm going to put a ladder. I'm going to put a ladder here. I'm going to put a ladder. Oh, here we go. There we go. Put a ladder on the top. And we might also connect in a bit of fence. The fence. Where's the redstone? No. Here we go. I just found it. Here we go. Nether brick fence. And I'll just connect that in there, maybe. Cross extra extra pipes or something okay so we've got that happening now as well and we've got the beginnings of the interior here so pretty much I'm just gonna be doing a bit of interior guys I'm gonna put in a couple of my cars off camera um, yeah my channels full of cars and stuff so there'll be plenty of cars to put in I'm gonna put in a couple of mechanic um, mechanical boxes yeah, and that's just consisting of red, wool, and black. A couple of signs with a bit of carpet on the top, which is grey, like that. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. I like it. Now with the roof, I'll put some of them in around. Might make a computer service center here as well, and a dyno tester. So if you guys know what that is, that's where you're testing the speed and the RPMs of your car. So I'm going to put that here. There's a nice toolbox there. You know what? I might put another one here, just to like a little box. Like so. Put one at the back here. One, two. You know, put a three. A three one here. Put one. He looks good. Let's do a standard box. Yeah, put one here as well. Like that. And probably one here. Okay, very good. Now, what I'm going to do as well, guys, is I'm going to do a couple of things. 
Um, right here, I'm going to put like racks. And I'm also going to put some tires, which you're going to have like a selection of different tires to put on your car. So the customer comes in and uh, sees a few things. I'm also going to put like butane colored gases, which will be here as well. And we'll fix the framework up on here. Well, look, it's coming along nicely. We're going to get all this happening very, very shortly. So I'm just going to quickly go and grab my black glass. We're going to pop that in over here like so. Tie it off with the carpet like that. Beautiful. And I'll put all that stuff in very shortly. Let's work on the roof. We're going to work on the roof now. And let's see. Uh, what to do? Okay, so that's all level. Service center. Actually, no. Let's work on this. We'll go up. Work up here. Three, five, fourteen. We'll work on this mechanical work center here. We can start working in the mechanics of racking and stuff. Um, 3514. Like that. And we'll connect this over here, like this. Let's have a look. Up like that. 3514. Alright, so we've got this interior to do. Let's lay out the flooring, grab that there, right over to the end. We'll keep this as stone, set one, just like that. And uh, if we might bring this up, let's grab that. If we bring that up as well, in here. Like that, gives it a double wall as connected in can actually have a window here as well and a doorway coming up to this point so it can be tall enough or do we make it a real modern mechanics where we go like four high big doorway we'll go four we'll go four like that to see how we go um, bring this across as well. Bring that across. Another one high. Like that. What do you think? I like it. I like Andy's layout here. It looks really, really good. It's going to work in our favor. Um, what I could do then is we could layer a layer of grass. Uh, grass the glass across the top we could just fill this in you know what I might fill this in and then we can actually put things up on the wall for display it's like a display wall yes I like it I like it so we've got that, we might fill in this bit here as well. Connect it all the way up to the top, to there. Set 35, 14, close that off. It's a bit dark in the corners, but that's all right. That's okay. Um, we could do a second level, come out for extra stuff. So what we could do as well is we could layer this connect it through so we'll just mark it there and keep Andy's flooring right through is that set five is it there we go so we've got the top layer as well and we connect it through here and here as well set five Boom. So that will allow us to have stairs if we want underneath. So let's just fly through here. 
and just make a doorway here for a second. Let's cut through. Yeah, so it's all dark in here. We've got the mechanics there. We've got this room here. We need lighting in here. So I might just get some glowstone for a minute. Glowstone. Pop that in so we can see what we're doing. Pop that there and up here as well. Alright, now what we can do is section this off. So we can have, let's see, we'll have shelves. Let me get some colored blocks. Yeah, jungle wood will do. And we'll put some shelves here. Shelves up the top. We'll connect that in here. Connect that in to the top. Like so. So we've got shelves there. We've got some shelves coming along here. And connect them up to the top again. shelves more things around here um, we need like a little desk in here right, we need a little desk in here and this is for when the mechanics do come out they can actually sign off on what they're actually using which will register in the offices and whatnot so what do we got two we got a three space gap here we need a one two three space gap there so that will come out there just like that. So we've got a little service center on the inside as well. And then we can continue this sort of pattern going through. And like that. Keeping a little space there. And we'll put stuff on there and do proper shelving and stuff. Uh, let's see. We're definitely going to put lights on the top, on the ceiling, because we're going to need to. I'll just randomize that for a minute. Uh, this will be closed off as well. Actually, no, we'll keep that, but we'll put a door, and that can be like an emergency exit. And we'll chuck another glowstone here. All right, so we've got this happening. We've got this beginning here. What else are we going to do? I can remove this now, so Andy will be able to see what we've got to left to work with. I'll pop that there, well edit that out. Slash slash cut. No, can't cut. Okay, I'll move that manually then. Go and delete stuff. It's cool. All right, so I'll move that in a second. We've got this out here. Still needs a couple of cars. I'm going to paste them in after this episode is finished. I'm going to design a logo. So on the next episode, um, or if Andy hasn't got a logo already, um, I'll put up an, a logo up here. Uh, maybe a racing flag up there, maybe. And I think then what we might do is start working on a color. So if you guys have got any ideas on what color palette Andy and I should be working on, please let us know in the comments down below. That would be absolutely freaking amazing. Um, thank you so much for the support, guys, and the views. Thank you for watching mine and Andy's Let's Build Dual Build together. Um, it doesn't feel like I've got much done, but we have we have indeed anyway guys go sub to Andy Andy is Yoda use the block server use the blocks texture pack all in the description guys all in the description go check out Andy for part two of this if you haven't need to catch up and part one on my channel so I will be doing episodes 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, etc, etc. And Andy will be doing all the even numbers. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. And uh, yeah, so we're making progress guys. We're starting to go out the back now. I might put a little uh, smoko hut down there as well. For the guys just to have a quick cigarette whilst their mechanical boredom sets in. But yeah, we're getting there guys very slowly.
Anyway, guys, thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, guys, I'll see you on the next one.